Sir, we've arrived at a world known as Imperius. The world has been inhabited before our arrival. There are two main islands to this small world. The creeper has a large presence on the eastern island, so we've set up a rift lab on the western island. The past inhabitants have constructed a bridge connecting the two islands. Probably before the arrival of the creeper, we've detected an extensive artillery battery on the north of our island, a forest to the south, and mines to the north as well. The creeper has somehow mimicked the artillery tactic of the past inhabitants. Watch out for those. Good luck, sir. Bam! Uh, welcome. Welcome, everybody, to Creeper World. Uh, okay, we've got just a, just a big old bridge, a whole load of creep, and not really a lot of time to defend. Uh, we've got a wood, we have green art, we've got just a little bit of everything going on. Um, and we gotta hold this bridge. If this thing falls, uh, we lose. Uh, so let's just start getting some stuff together. I, okay, normally, this would be a classic, okay everyone, let's, let's overbuild. Um, I don't think I can actually do that this time. Okay, right, maybe, maybe this will work. I don't quite know how long that is going to hold. Okay, well, guns are forming. Uh, okay, the wall is about to fall, but we're kind of building okay. I think if I can just survive the initial wave... Uh, it is looking super close. Okay, right, that looks like it might be okay. Right, give me a refinery. Okay, they do have crimson, but that should kind of chill out. Once those stashes stop being goofballs. Okay, we're kind of fine. Uh, if I can get that shield up and running, uh, the bridge will forever be secure. Uh, okay, right. Let's just uh, overbuild. Oh shoot, I completely forgot about missiles. Uh, <laughs> okay, they literally warned me. Uh, if I can get a couple of these up and running. Nuts. Oh, I got so complacent so fast. I don't think I'm going to have time. Okay, actually, right. We should be all right. We've got enough anti-creep that this shouldn't... Sh we shouldn't fall. Plenty of space to make planes. Uh, there's a green R supply. Probably need a couple of pylons up in here. Uh, and had all the urns, so let's just turn all that stuff on. Probably would make more sense to actually put this on some of the guns. Uh, and you know what? I will make all of those uh, John Rambos. Okay, it's a lot of missiles, a lot of spores coming down. There's a lot of blobs, a lot of skimmers. Uh, ooh, okay, skimmers actually taking down my front line, which ain't super hot. How's the missile collection? Kind of bad. Okay, right, we, uh, although there was a little bit of, uh, goofing. Kind of, not the end of the world there. Uh, so, I think we are probably... Wait, are they firing again already? Oh, heck, okay, fine. Uh, how do we want this? So, but like that, should be fine. Uh, I guess maybe we want some, like, super snipers, just kind of vaguely covering. Okay, that all seems pretty good. Uh, some special... Let's get some M rifts up. And can I make more berthers? Oh my god, we can. Oh, okay, right. Uncapped berthers. Wow, I don't think I've ever played a map that has uncapped berthers. Do berthers take urns? <gasps> they do. Right, that artillery is not doing a lot to me. I gotta watch out, because this stuff can actually flow up and cause problems. So I do need a few cannons just strategically dotted around. Right, the front line is kind of fine. I want to see if I can just land a gun up there, and we can use this as, like, a starting outpost. Okay, all of you guys, auto. Fire. <laughs> okay, there's a lot of artillery going back and forward. Okay, we should be able to hold that. Once I can get an Emrith set up, turning that into mines, uh, like uh, mortars. 
I guess a bit of island hopping might be involved. Uh, God, they've got, uh, they've just maxed out their eggs already. Woof. Uh, but actually, that's not bad, because it means that they're not going to be firing any more into places that I can't control. Okay, we've got, we've got a lot of artillery to fire. I'm not being too cautious with where it's going. Uh, but that is feeling pretty good, although i got to be careful. I need to take this out, these two guys first, before I start dropping dropping their creep down. Um, I need some beacons. Right, okay. Uh, Artie, I actually need you to do a better plan for me. Just bombard this area. Uh, okay, I've got an advanced beacon, which hopefully... Hopefully we'll live. Um, just so I can move in. Because if I can disable those, those are the strongest emitters. Heck, maybe it's worth just getting a ton of sprayers up there. Right, you guys. So, if they are always on... How's my blue production? Not amazing, but that's fine. Okay, you. Always on. Ah, oh, no, my boy. My sweet baby. If I can keep it away from their crimson, I don't even need the... AC on this. Oh, God. They're in my midst. Yeah, I was a bit slow on uh, sniper sniper base protection. Luckily, the artillery strike is just doing just great work. Just fantastic work for everyone involved. Good job to you. Oh, good for you. Oh, okay, there's no overloading. Right. Sad times, but be okay. We just need extra snipers and even maybe a couple of missiles up here in the old the old fortress. Right, their main stuff is shut down. So I think it's only the eggs which are going to be a big problem. Uh, now, everyone can fire auto wherever you want. Wow, I'm like really light on red. Interesting. That is a big problem. I guess, like, we were building more M-Rifts and stuff. Uh, but the front line looks okay. They kind of produce on and off. Uh, my resources are kind of fine. Okay, can we flat an AC and uh, high paths? Oh, the little, the little mortar that could. can go up there. Right, they're going to just kind of roughly clear some areas out. God, but it is actually just making these guys generate just a ton more. Okay, try not to burst too many eggs because we're kind of just keeping them producing. But if I can stop them flowing, actually making front lines will be a little bit better. Man, little mortar island did just fantastic work. Uh, do you want to try that again somewhere else? God, deep, deep in enemy lines. That's a little too deep. Oh, hold out for 20 minutes. Super easy. You know, just while we're hanging, have some shields. I just kind of forget about shields. What do we want? We've got good green R. Maybe it's worth getting a, just a couple of rockets. Okay, the RT is doing a pretty good job kind of like controlling, controlling the enemy movement. I think we can go up to a slightly faster speed. Uh, who's exploded? Uh, some random guy. Okay. And do some refining there. Uh, maybe get just a row of guns because we can. Right, we're slowly actually beginning to lower it down now, which is good. Let's just get, make a new front line up here where we can. Might be a little bit aggressive, but that's probably fine. It have some snipers, a row of cannons, uh, guard your flank, and that's quite a lot of building that we're doing. Maybe some might argue too much building, but not me. Taking them out probably is the next sensible play. God, like, look at all of the eggs. It's just egg city up here. Do we want more artillery? I think the answer is is yes. Why would you ever ask that question? 
Okay, maybe that's too much to build. Okay, right, maybe we're building too much artillery. It's just they never get the option to, and so I want to see what happens when you build too much. Uh, stuff is feeling all right. I want to take that out next. I did have a lone terraformer. Okay, I thought this was going to be a lot simpler, but actually the eggs are really making this, like, last bit of defense kind of tough to get through. Okay, my gigantic artillery camp is all ready to go. Uh, why are you not building? Some a deficit. A big deficit. What is the issue? Do I have just too much arty? I think that literally is the maybe the problem because they all need to be reloaded and so nothing else will build what is the problem here why are you not ever taking ammo is that not connected okay right i think we gotta proceed old school style uh mortars come up here we're gonna we're taking this flank first oh, let's bring like a random collection of weapons up I want to take out the skim factory and then get these emitters. Because not only will that give me some prime real estate, uh, which, you know, is going to be good, good for business, but it will lower their creep production nicely. All right, that can connect. Well, I've got a super sniper somewhere here. Do you want to come up and just blast? Stop blasting. Uh, that front line should hold, and we can take the next island. Oh, there's a boy. Do I even have missiles around here? Uh, oh, Super Sniper. Super Sniper did, did some work. His orbs did not make it. Okay, right, they dealt with that. It could flow and cause me a few issues, but probably okay. Okay, let's take our Skimmer Island. I need a... There's a pair of John Rambos going, going up this time. I think their powers combined should be enough. Come over here. Wow, that Emirath never got built. Yeah, the red on has actually been, like, kind of limited. Okay, this island should be mostly secure. We could still get blobbed a little bit. Um, I don't want too many snipers, like, on the hard edges, because I don't want to burst all the, the eggs this very second. You going to be okay there, bud? There's a lot of creep you're dealing with. You're very brave. You're a very brave, brave little boy. Well done. Okay, next, maybe is this. Okay, if I can just get that tower built. I don't know if it will. No. Uh, yeah, okay. John Rambo, hold the island. Um, bring some friends up to play. Okay, right, might be time to start trying to break some eggs over here. Where did my super sniper go? Here? Is that too many eggs to pop in one go? No. Because I'm going to make it rain. Okay. Yeah, the rain, like, you know, covering fire as the, the eggs are getting popped. Actually, pretty nice. Pretty healthy. Uh, you guys are not really shooting anything, so come on up and take part. Okay, you come up and nullify. Right, now that I'm actually using the shields, uh, my arg is real good. For some reason, I don't know why, I still always think that shields run on, um, lift deck. I think it's because, like, the totems or whatever get powered by lift deck. And just, like, it's just in my head for no reason at all. Uh, right, those are almost nullified. Then we'll be close to getting in deep. Okay, we've got them pretty nicely penned in. Uh, minor egg problems here and there, but that's kind of kind of to be expected. Always got to expect a couple of eggs uh, when you're dealing with uh, dealing with the creep. Uh, that is quite a lot of egg. Let's just give them a little bit of a little bit of rain. Oh, jeez, that is too many eggs. Is it too many? That is like getting real deep. Uh, by here is not feeling so hot. Little more rain, maybe. A little more. We lost the tower, but 
So, okay. No one panic. It is going to be a grind to get in there. So they go back up to max eggs immediately. Uh, that is quite a lot of creep coming out to play. And we are kind of beginning to run a little bit lower on rain. Okay, we've got them relatively hemmed in. I think now is the time to see what happens here. Do we want to just fire all of the artillery at once? I think it's all basically loaded. Because, <laughs> like, this is just where the eggs can spawn, where they don't get instantly sniped. Uh, let's just see what happens. Oh, wait. Clear all the targets. I guess I should probably save, like, there to be a, f a first rank fire, second rank fire. You know, treat this like... The, the movie Zulu. Um, because as the... <laughs> so many guns. I don't want them all just to fire in one big volley, because that will just pop eggs. But it might be amazing. My economy is bad. Uh, how's the eggs doing? Oh, does it not? Well, maybe it does pop eggs. I'm not entirely sure. Oh, it is. Oh, it definitely is. Uh, it is lagging pretty hard. I feel like maybe I'll just give it a little bit of support rain in there. The creep is coming out. Okay. Wow. Right, we are popping eggs, but... Not super quickly. Oh, God, like, they're just flying around now. It's kind of making gains there, which I don't care for. Bring up another kill team. Um, but my my economy shot. I can't have all the guns firing because otherwise my front lines might go down. So it's <laughs> it's this is amazing. That much artillery firing. It's kind of causing a little bit of lag. Um, I'm surprised how well it's actually working. Eggs going down. Um, I think I can probably afford to bring up some frontline snipers into this. Okay, we're just gonna let them all reload. We destroyed like half the eggs. It's honestly not a lot of eggs. Um, I can't really build that much. Okay, right, the economy is back in action. Right, there's a plan. There's a plan forming. Uh, snipers to the front line, please. Uh, I could do with artillery firing sooner rather than later. <laughs> there's too much artillery. Rain. Rain. Why is the artillery not firing yet? Oh, armed. Fuck, they're all gonna fire at once. Godspeed. Wow, that artillery strike! Bonk! <laughs> Just like... <laughs> okay. Okay, should not have fired all in just one mega volley. That doesn't make sense. Uh, it's kind of jokes. Wow, just like the wave coming down. God, the amount of damage that does. Uh, still not really dealing with their eggs. But... Just crunch. Man, like the amount of creep. It drops it down to like 9k. Which is nuts. Wow, I went from like 9k up to like 100k pretty fast. I think, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna make a drastic play here. I'm gonna destroy some of my guns. Because I'd rather a few of them firing consistently. And it not breaking my bank. Uh... And the reason why I'm destroying them, rather than just having, leaving some disabled. I guess I could just make a group. But I'd rather just like click on one and just press Control A. Because laziness. Nice, okay, so they can be armed. And we're totally fine with the bank. Okay, nice. The artillery comes in, really like drains their supply. Uh, we can actually support maybe a few more. But we'll wait for some of the nullification to be done. Okay, so this is why I didn't want to just be turning different ones on and having different groups, like, I just wanted to be able to move them more simply. Uh, maybe we could have done it with the groups. How many eggs are left? 50 eggs! God, it's taken 
Taking us a while to get to here. Rain. Rain. Oh, God. We definitely lost some nullifies. Jeez. Okay, eggs down to nothing. It's just when the, that egg wave comes out, God, a lot of stuff appears. I need to actually, like, build a proper, proper defensive line. Okay. <laughs> this is kind of like actually just like a weird puzzle now. As it's kind of hard work getting in there. I'm just not sure like how I can ever get close enough to get the nullifiers on. Okay, two down. Okay, if you can build any of these nullifiers at all. Then we can get one wave closer. Uh, I've got a whole load of stuff. Good to go. Yeah, this feels like this should probably work. And it's a lot of, a lot of work to get in there. Okay, how many have we stopped on the front line? Great, a whole load of them. Uh, you have to move, sir. Thank you. Thank you for your, your cooperation. And someone's hitting the back line. Oh! Oh, God. <laughs> for a second I thought, like, oh, they've all chilled out. Okay, they've only got five left. Right. Two here. God, like, the glowing... That density. Don't stare directly into it. Like, that'll make you go blind, Towers. Uh, okay, everyone is disabled. We have taken that. Uh, let's just get all of these ready to go. Uh, right, we've got relics to find. Okay, uh, right. The relic is in here. The mystery that we've been searching for. Uh, terraform. Gimme that. Just go big. Let's just see how quickly they can sort this out. Also, I like it when they do nearest first. Um, go for it. Unleash hell on that mountain. Uh, honestly, thought it'd be a bit faster, but I guess it's the lag. I guess it's just lagging. What could it be? What could it be? <laughs> Who knows? Huzzah, I guess. Uh, well, we did the quest. See ya. Uh, yeah, that was cool. Man, God, it was actually like real hard to poke through that last part. Um, my God. Wow, who played this for 5 hours 48? Um, well, that was some Creeper World. I hope you all enjoyed it. Until next time, everybody, farewell. Goodbye.